Hey, what's up, everyone? It's your friend 23 here, and welcome back to a new episode of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, I was thinking today we're gonna explore the depths some more. It was quite a few episodes while when we while we did. It's been quite a few episodes since we did it, and um, I was thinking. Also, why I want to go down to the depths is because I saw a video yesterday on YouTube uh, displaying a really good vehicle to, to build. The video I saw was uh, this is the best vehicle in Tears of the Kingdom made by YouTuber Two Uncle to Dane. Uh, I will hopefully edit in the thumbnail for that video here on screen, and also I will link to that video in the description. So that design is. All taken from him. Uh, so why not just go down here and we need a, some type of platform where there are parts to build. And if I remember correctly, that might be one actually. So why not just quick travel here and see. Let's just bring out a quick little uh, beam here, so we can see where it is. It's too dark to see it, but uh, we can uh, see it on the map where we're going. And why I want to build this is because it's rel relatively easy to to like. Um... Oh, this word is ah, oh, it's word is here. I was like, it's it's already taken from earlier. Uh, why I want to build this is because the parts are really easy. It's two fans and one steering wheel. Uh, and I know I haven't found a steering wheel dispenser yet, like a candy machine thingy. So... Oh my god, here we have an enemy. So I'm gonna build it down here, because steering wheels are really prevalent here in the depths. Uh, and even though I don't have the steering wheel... You can use the auto build function after you have done the design. And you can use Sonai to um, to pay for the part you don't have. So it's it's really cheap that way uh, as well. So so that's it's a good flying the machine that's really cheap in in building materials, which is nice. I will just uh, think I will just take this damage. Yeah, <laughs> it's okay. We're not really down here for fighting at the moment. Hopefully we have... A, I, otherwise, I have already... I was just saying, if it's no steering wheel here, I know a place that has it now when I'm thinking about it. It's it's near this one. It was up here somewhere. You had, like, you could build things. So we're gonna go there instead. Sorry for this little... Uh, uh, mismatch. There we go. Nice, we get our life back as well, so just quickly eat an apple or two. So if I remember correctly, over here you had the parts for building... Oh, <laughs> maybe not jump down straight down there. Uh, build... You have parts for building um, with a steering wheel, and that's what we want. Because fans I will probably have on me as well. I have two, and it's two that we need, so that's everything we need, actually. So just get some height here so we can flew over, or fly over. Might have been a bit early, actually. I think it's okay, we will manage. We have quite a lot of stamina at the moment. Of the last time, last episode's uh, refill. <laughs> Finally, I've like spoken about refilling my health We're uh, turning in the light blessings in for like three episodes, and I finally managed last last episode, which is good Oh Hello dudes mm. Oh 
Why not take some Poe over here? So hopefully, yeah. Hope I was just saying hopefully the uh, the things respawn here, but they have done. So we're gonna need one of these. One of uh, the fans. Oh, hello. Thank you. Ah, look, we have, even have a fan over here, so we can save those we have on us. We need these three components and a flat building area, which is here. <laughs> so, so yes, let's just start getting to building. And so according to this dude, you start with a fan facing downward, flat on the ground. And then you take one of the, st the steering wheel here. And uh, first of all, I will show you. First of all, you're gonna tip it upwards so it looks like this. But you want the steering wheel towards you. And here is the most tricky part, according to him. You have to like center it really good on the top of the um, of the thing there. And centering in it is the most important thing. And that actually looks pretty centered to be honest. So, so maybe I was just lucky because he, he struggled for a bit. But he, he he did this on the first try though, so maybe I will fail over here. Uh, and then the last uh, fan should also be flat down, but it you will attach it to the tip where I'm like aiming there. And also it should be straight of course. So you have to like... Line it up as good as you can. I think... I want to be a bit closer, actually. Should we just try there? I hope that is straight enough. So how can I save this design now? It's this one. And you can set it as favorite if we like it. So we're gonna try it first of all. To see if it's... That's actually pretty... <laughs> pretty great. First try build. You see, it's like a... S flying... Um... Oops. It's like a flying mo motorcycle. So, so with this design, we're gonna be able to travel a lot quicker up in the overworld. So that's like the main reason why I wanted to buy uh, to build it. So with that done and set as a favorite, why we wanna also e explore a bit more of the of the depths today is because now when we have this design, we really wanna increase the amount of batteries we have on us. Oh my god. Because as you see right now, my battery level isn't... I only have two permanent batteries. And also one thing you can do in the depths that you showed in the video is put a big, bright seed there. Oh my god. <laughs> and there it goes. It's lucky that we have the design now, so we don't even have to go and get that. We can just... boom. Take that out. See, it only costs nine of the Zonites to build it without the parts. Okay, let me just out of build it. I don't really care. Uh, you can put these on, but they only shoot straight forward. So let me put a bright seed on, but be I'm gonna be more 
ready that it also turns off on. So let me throw it and then quickly just hit it again. Perfect. So with that bright seed on, you have a really good thing that lights up everywhere for you. So even if you explore places that are where you haven't been before, you will not be too blinded. See, this is some, so, some real nice traveling, actually. Now we're gonna start eating up on our other battery there. Perfect <laughs> landing. So here we can buy some uh, crystallized charge, because that's what we want. We have 14 of these. So I'll... Ah, I need one more, huh? And I take all but one. And one battery, we need 300 of these for like one full battery. Also, let's save some if we need to build our machine again. <laughs> so that's two, two builds, which is good. Now we have 130 crystallized charges. So let's take the bike over this way. I saw a camp. I was thinking maybe some loot is there. Yeah, because we want to loot a lot of um, those today. And we're also going to take a photo on them so we can track them with the sensor we have. See, you see how easy we can... Oh! <laughs> I need to learn how to park better, though. Uh, how easy we can just uh, travel around in the depths now with, with that thing. And also, it's gonna be a blast overworld as well. So let's just sneak up on these dudes. And I have also gotten a question from uh, a viewer why I don't use these on my weapons as much. I just thought it it only improved like the damage done and not the durability. But he told me it's also improved durability, so I'm gonna start upgrading my weapons more again. Because why I didn't do it because is I don't want the fights to be too easy. So let's drop one of these. Oops. Did that sound trigger anything? That's nice. That looks like a. Oof, that's a really nice looking sword, actually. Um, it's like a big samurai sword. This dude is really watching over the place. So let's just try to snipe him in the head. That's a nice little one shot. They haven't seen me. Which is good. Oh my god, can't I sneak up here? That's a bit unfortunate. Okay, we manage either way. I wanna try to get a sneak strike on this to see if I one shot him. We did. Okay, now they have seen me. But it's only the Boca Lob Lobos left. Boom. Ah, it's one of these also. Boom. There we go. And here is one as well. With the burning stick, huh? Where are you going? Ah. Wow. What happened to his weapon? <laughs> Just disappeared. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. So let's also first photo this. That's really important to do. Because now we can track them on our um, sensor plus thing. Oh, 
Look, a lot of Zone Knights here. This is really nice. So I guess the goal for this... Oh my god. The ep goal for this episode is not to burn up my... My Iron Box Hammer. But it's to... Get a lot of these loot, so knights and grand so knights or larger knights, uh, and also light up the depths some more because we haven't gotten a lot of them. We have a lot of things to explore still here, and we might actually try to like have a goal to go to the east uh, thing from the for the for the is it a side adventure? Yeah. This Master Kuga Yen Clan. So, so that might be the like goal on where we're going. And we try to light up on our way. That sounds like a good plan, actually. Can we take this? No, we have it all. At the moment. Uh, okay. Wanna destroy these just to watch if we can get some nice arrows or something? See, five, five of them. Two more. That was worth. And my car dropped down there because I parked a bit, <laughs> bit too hectic. So let me just build, build a new little bike for me. Boom. And let's also throw a light on it. But before we do it, change to another weapon so we can turn it off quickly. Put it there. And boom. Nice. And also while we're going down here, it could be nice to have already some extra energy. Let's just get some temporary. Put in a on the device dispensary or use it simply parenthesis on it. Okay. So the large one. Okay, I understand. Now we have some extra. I wonder if you can put batteries on this as well. That would make it more um, useful, to be honest. So we're going east. So let's try to light some of these places up here. So you see, even though it's really dark, you get to see where the mountains are appearing. Oh, there we have some loot. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not sure what to do when when that happens. Okay, you can just crash down a bit. Here we have some bomb arrows. Actually, it's nice. Ah, here they are also, some enemies. Oh my god, this dude needs a bomb in his face. Need a new bow. Can you stop uh, <laughs> crouching, please? Are you gonna destroy my bike? Wow, nice hit. Didn't think you would three, three hit me there. And I can't heal those as well. That's no good. How come you're so annoying with your shield? Now I got that perfect. Wow. Three again, huh? Uh, luckily, I think I have done one of those uh, foods for down here. Or have I eaten it stupidly sometime?
I'm not sure what I'm looking at for. <laughs> Maybe I haven't done those. I thought I did some of those. But I must have not done it. This dude is way too... Pain in the ass. There, we got a crit. Put out your samurai sword also. There you go. Now you're not so... Cocky anymore. But damn, that's a lot of damage taken. That's no good. Some more so night. Always nice. Are you trying to throw stone on me all the way from there? can play that game, both of us. Stop hiding behind that thing, <laughs> dude. That's no fair, huh? I would say at least two of those looked like a crit from my perspective, but... I guess the game knows better. A lot of loot, though, which is nice. Some arrows back. Oh, those we don't want to hit. They can blow up our loot. That's no good. It's almost worth going back and uh, buying the last things over there of crystallized charges. Because I don't know how often they refill those. Let me just quickly go back here. I think you all understand why I want to improve my battery count, because... We don't take... we don't go far at the moment with only two batteries. I wanna buy your supply. It's a deal. And also here. Yes. But can I like talk to him and he will refill? This we have talked to before, so I'm not gonna... No, he, he don't refill by me talking to him. So that's actually good, because... Those mine par places are not... We have a, we only have unlocked two at the moment. This mine here and this one. So we have... Not an unlimited supply of buying those crystallized charges. So it's good to buy out where we, where we are. Okay, so let's keep on uh, embarking here. Guess we can follow this, like, uh, mine shaft uh, thingy. <laughs> the mine rails. Here we have a nice little weapon we wanna take. Always with the crouching there. Oh my god, can you please get up? Can't carry anymore, huh? I guess we are okay with uh, throwing away that one. Uh, we wanna boost that weapon as well. Let's try it with uh, one of these. They look fun. Yeah. Boom. Boom. And change weapon first. <laughs> nice. That's a good looking weapon. Uh, 
And off we go. I don't want to say that I've started being better on the landing yet, because I'm not. <laughs> but the two last landings have went okay, at least. Now, there we have the next uh, lighti lightning thing to unlock the map. That was a good landing, actually. Let's refill the battery a bit. Before we're off again. That's clean. So here we have probably a lot of ores inside here, which is nice to clear out. I think we have cleared this place once before. Or maybe not, actually. What do we have? Yeah, because we came from here, right? If I remember correctly. Because those uh, statue was the thing we felt followed on the first quest here. So he is looking out for enemies. Let's just try to sneak into their little base from here. Just to have some oversight. So he's the one alarming, so he's the one we want to snipe first. Let's take a bow with a little ex- Oh, he saw me, sure thing. And we need to be quick with our headshot. Ah, he already... He was quick on alarming. Oh my god, I still haven't... Uh... That's no good for fighting. <laughs> I'm like one hit away from death. I forgot that I didn't reset my life. And these dudes are so quick. I can easily die here. Was close. Dude, 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 dude. Oh my god, you jumped straight in front of that. That's perfect, actually. Okay, we have three enemies. We wanna murder, <laughs> murder. We wanna kill this, this dude first because he's so quick. Ah, oh my god, huh? Okay, run, 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 run quickly. We need height. That's the most important part at the moment. Some distance, and then jump so we can slow mo this. Oh my god. Also, please hit your shots. That makes everything a bit easier. Oh my, are you joking me? <gasps> oh my god, that's so close of dying. So we're gonna go back here and <laughs> loot uh, the ores before, uh, after I have uh, refilled my life. Because I can die from... Uh, Whatever right now. I'm almost a little afraid of taking my bike if I get hurt in the fall damage. But I will take the bike and I will jump up off it up in the air just to glide down. And then we can make a new bike if this gets lost. <laughs> I think that's the most uh, safe way to approach this. And we're not gonna talk to the dude in the in the tent there because he's probably gonna be a Giga dude. And this is nice, so we can jump off here and just glide down, so we don't accidentally take fall damage. And soon here I can breathe out. Nice. Cleanse the darkness and cleanse my life. <laughs> Thank you. That was well needed. And our bike also landed pretty good. So let's go back and loot that place we just cleared. Ah, there were one enemy left, huh? <laughs> he was like, I noticed nothing. Oops. 
I need to be quicker on the let go and the reapply control because I'm the motors is stopping way too too hard for me there. Okay, let's just aimbot this dude. Boom. Is that enough? Yeah. I take your fire fruits with ease. Thank you. Because I've been here before, I don't think any chests are left. Because they despawn, I guess. But that's fine. We're not out after... After uh, chests, we're out after this sweet, sweet so night loot. That's a nice little detail that water can... Uh, like, take out the fire on these. Because that's like an easy detail to miss when coding the game. Maybe, <laughs> I don't know. I'm no coder. Or maybe all fire have like the same base code, which is if water touches fire, turn fire out or something like that. Uh, uh, who knows? This was a big vein of Sonite, which is so nice. With the cost of a car for only nine, you can like... After one of those howls, you have enough to buy a, build a new car to get you to the next place to, to loot. Which is nice. So let's keep going to the left. Or east, if we're going at the compass way. <laughs> it was left for me when I started there. I think I saw one in the distance, yeah, 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 over there. So it can be smart to do that, just to... Like, see what where they are. That's better. So be like, really... Oh, really quick with it. I really wanna fight here as well, because... Looks like they have a lot of... So night here as well. We'll probably try to headshot both of these dudes. Oh my god. <laughs> That's no headshot. That's a miss. That's a miss again. This has couldn't have gone worse. <laughs> One is dead at least, or even both died. Oh, these dudes, they need to... No explosion though, because I don't want to blow up all the ores. But they need a headshot to their face though. To start everything off. It would be nice to have one of those dead. And also these are probably one shots. Nice. I like that I had a lot of these to p apply on my arrows. Okay, let's help our friend. Take out the samurai sword. That's it, huh? Nice. Mobling guts. Okay. Some Sonite. It's nice that they also drop Sonite from killing them. Ah, oh, you're still here, huh? Not anymore. Here also we don't want to ex make these explode in here. That will just do that. Maybe we can kill two birds in one stone, no. I think maybe this could crush the Sonite, but it couldn't. And also, I'm wondering, are these... Does this count as an other chest than the one we've taken a picture on? No, they are both counted as the same. But that looks better, to be honest. I'm gonna keep that picture. Also, it can actually be smart to just 
pin this as like here is good loot. And what should we take loot for? I guess I use these usually as loot. <laughs> So I have like apple trees, I think I have that for apple trees as well. And we can like put in memory, like in my brain, that that icon in, in the depths means uh, so night. This is gonna break soon, so let's just make it break. We should probably do one more of these. And I will do it with a long sword, because two-handed is better, I think, for destroying those, um, those ore types. Because it's one hit instead of two. Some more... Arrows, nice, nice, nice. This is also good for for collecting some arrows, to be honest. I wonder how long this bike will uh, last. We have uh, used it for a bit now without it breaking. I actually thought it would have a worse lifespan than, than it had have had this far. And it was to the green place, if I remember correctly. So it's going here. And here we have weapons. So we will probably just park a little bit quickly here. Thank you. Is that a spear? Yeah, I don't want it. I don't want the spear. Thank you anyway. I will try to get up to this treetop over here. Because it looked like a grand pole. Oh my. Not the most elegant landing. <laughs> But it's okay, maybe we can reach it from... no. Never mind then. Where did our bike go? It's down there. I will go and get it, but I saw this. Why not? Free Zonite. Oh! Not free at all. Oh. Almost free Zonite. So if you just quickly detach and then attach again, you get a nice, pretty nice landing actually. If you're close, close to the ground. Nice, nice, nice. I will keep going with the bike. I just want to stress test it, how, like how many, how far you can go on it. Because these like wings and everything, they would have broke for a long time ago. It's actually crazy the durability on this thing. And there we're going. There we're going. Of course we're going there. But that's a nice little landing. Yeah. Okay, they have one of those also. We should photo that. Because we have done it on the ice like likes, but never on these ones. That's nice. Pokolobens we should have done on. Uh, I guess we just... I don't want to leave my bike down, up here though. That's actually a great parking. <laughs> Okay, we will focus on that last, so start with this dude, and he's probably a one hit. Oh. He would have been if I can aim, <laughs> but I cannot. I think that didn't aggro any, any else. 
the sneak gear is too strong. Oh, is that rock-like? Those we can also photo. It's hard to dif difference the, the difference with all that gloom on them, but it's okay, I think. Okay, so we have one, two, three. We don't want to blow up too much of the ore, but we need to blow up the light-like. The rock-like. So we're gonna use one actually on him. Because I guess that hit one of them. Are you saw me now? Hello. Yeah, that was a bad hit taken. That hit me? What hit me? Oh, it was probably the light light that hit me. Not the most cleanest start of the fight, huh? But it's okay. Wow. I see you, dude, with your armor. Let me bring out the heavy artillery. Wow. Boom. Good thing we're near a uh, healing station. Or those yep. uh, light seeds. Light trees or what they're called. I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't want that. I want this. I want that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you're here. What's your plan, huh? What's your plan? It's gonna chill over there. Do I need to go up to you? Here I am. Eat me. Thank you. I thought that was a hit, but it was not. Gonna eat me again. I'm super jammy. Oh. <laughs> not the easiest place to walk at. Nice. Can I get up here quickly? Oh my god. Is that enough? Yeah. Feels like this always drops shields. <laughs> yeah, yeah, rock salt. But that's actually good for cooking. Nice with some more arrows. I never say no thank you for those. Large Zonite, 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 Zonite. I take them all. And the bike? Was right outside here, yeah. Some more loot. I can have easily missed some more, yeah. It was a good vein. Oh, nice, two of them even. And they dropped quite a lot, actually. Even more here, damn. Two more. This place deserves a uh, marking on my map. Anything else? Can be, no. But that was a great loot, actually. Let me just mark you down as well. That's a great place for Zonite. And my bike is standing here and waiting. Such a good little bike. Still haven't broke yet, which is super weird. Oh my god, it's another ore deposit here. Oh, that's not the best place to land. <laughs> that was my own fault. And I'm not sure I want to fight this with 3 HP. We should go there first and just play it safe. I'll be back for you dudes. 
I promise. This is much smarter thing to do, actually. Nice, nice, nice. And it looks like a big camp was nearby, looking at the map quickly there. Let me just check that. This thing. Ooh, a bar bargainer statue. We had that out on the map from before, but we've never been here. So we're gonna check that out. But first, let's fly back and loot that deposit, because it looked like great loot and few enemies. And on the way, we also have a little ore deposit over here. Oh, there's those. I remember these dudes from Tears of the... Oh, Breath of the Wild. They are not fun dudes. This we should also just quickly put on the map, because here was free, free zone night without even fighting, and a lot of them. And what did this dude carry? A spear? I don't want spears at the moment. Ah, almost free loot, huh? Oh my god, he's gonna roll down. I don't want to fight uh, the big center guy quite yet. Today we take the fights we have to. To get this loot we have to take the fight. Oh, we should also heal. <laughs> Otherwise... We could have fought them before the, the light, the, the root. Did these see me? I, mean, I don't see them though. My god, that's bad. Okay, this should be pretty straightforward. Don't bomb them. I want to change this and I want to put on... Mm -mm -mm. Why not this? This we have even more of. And maybe a headshot? No, but a one, one shot kill. Either way. You don't see me. Now you do. <laughs> and you went straight back to work, huh? Ah. Boom. Ooh, boom. Nice headshots all over the place here. That was great. These spears actually look pretty nice, but they are not. Why not mark this also? Because it was an easy little kill for... An okay, um, pretty much actually. A good amount of... Um, so night worse. Like, how many am I collecting? I'm not sure. As many as I find on my way to the abandoned ruin, I guess. And with the speed we're going, it's gonna take a while, huh? Because we started over here. <laughs> We've gone one third of the way. That's okay. Some some episodes you need to just gather resources to make the future episodes more effective. Because with this dude, we can like we, we we're never gonna have tr trouble uh, 
playing around when we get more batteries. And can we please just pause for a moment? This It's still the, the same bike as we started this long journey on. That's crazy, actually. Okay, so we're going to the right then. But I see a deposit over here. Park a bit away from them so we can sneak up. Rock hammer sure. We can use it to break things with. But that is good for fighting. And we want to snipe this dude. Hopefully a headshot. That's not even close enough. Huh? Better, but no headshot. And he had time. That's unfortunate. This dude that runs up here. Oh, there are two of them. They're always so goddamn quick. Well, I thought he was just jumping towards me, not hitting me there. Nice headshot. That was it, huh? These are nice to have. Because they made a nice looking uh, samurai sword. Oh yeah, hello. Oh, I need actually to take a picture on you guys. For a quest in... Is it Hat Hateno village? No, oh, no, no, don't kill them. <laughs> I need a, a picture on them. That's great. Now we can kill them. And also, have I taken a picture on these skellies? Nope, that's a cool picture. Maybe we shouldn't use this good weapon on one-shot kill enemies. But that's a bit too late now, and it's also breaking, so I'm gonna throw it away. the car Boom. I was one enemy left I think I heard someone yeah yeah we just chilled here <laughs> you keep on chilling also this is also a place I want to mark because uh, a lot of Sonite ore and also the people, the enemies here, carried a lot on their back. Which is nice. Oh, no. Destroy. Destroy. So here we off. We say no to the loot to get these instead. Starting to get an okay amount of um, so night actually. Yes, we take this bow for now. Better than nothing. And we keep going. Spear. No need to land. Oh shit, we forgot. Or I forgot rather. We need to look, look out of this place. I guess it's up here. If I could guess. So we're gonna run out of battery soon, I think. Oh my god. That's so far up. That's not good. <laughs> 
Sometimes I fail with my uh, flying, but what is this? I'm just curious on what this is. I wonder if you can use the same design and build uh, with wheels, like a m more ground motorcycle. I know the flying one is better, but it would be cool to have one for the ground as well, when you just want to cruise. Oh, we're not even going up there. <laughs> I'm just a bit stupid here right now. It can be good to look at the map where you're going. Okay. And also... Turn the bike before you start it, because you can't those, do those sharp turns. Okay, so it's this thingy. It looks like a, some type of enemy claw or something. Ooh, no, 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 it's the Poe statue guy. What up, dude? How are you? You who stand before me, make an offering. Offer pose to me, spirit that ought to return to afterlife. They are pitiful beings who have lost their way home and wander this land. I am one who returns all pose to the afterlife without prejudge. Good, evil, that's the future perspective of narrow-minded beings. There is no such distinction, distinction in wandering spirits. I take it you have encountered my brethren? Stay a moment. Is this the same dude uh, as up in the up in the lookout landing? My brethren and I have combined our power to create the tunic of the death. You desire it, you must make a suitable offering. Uh, so 150, huh? This is gloom resistance. Ooh, that's actually good. We're gonna we're gonna buy that. And turn it on. And then turn it, equip it. Looks good there also. But I want it in white though. So that's something we need to do. I want all my gear to be in white for the future. So that's a good look, I think. So with gloom resistance, because I see a one heart there on my... Like next to the... The weapon menu up there. Is it that... I can resist one gloom effect, and then I need to cleanse the the, the clothes as well. That's my theory, theory at least. Oh, what the hell is this? This is looking scary. Oh, it's one of those. I will not fight my first construct uh, boss down in the depths. It's crazy how long this machine works without breaking. Maybe it won't break at all. Maybe these parts are like infinite. But we need to re <laughs> we need to recharge though. All my batteries all are, are almost out. And I saw the next thing we were flying to. Even though we're going not 100% correct way at the moment, we're mapping out the place, which is good. Oh, let me refill first. Can be smart. There we go. That looks like a big uh, camp. Maybe it's a Giga camp even. Okay, we're going there after... After we land and lock up the map over here. Not the best place to get... Run out of batteries, so let me just... Refill it for a bit. It looked like a lot of gloom out down there. Also, one of those refill everything. That's crazy good, actually. And yes, some extra. 
So when we have like six permanent batteries, you can use one of those large and it will give you full energy again, huh? That's actually crazy. Like imagine how hard it would be to cross all this gloom to get here if we didn't have this flying machine. Then that's a nice little descent. Boom. <laughs> Not the softest landing though. That's nice. We have a two, two heal. I don't know. I'm thinking maybe this bike doesn't break. <laughs> the part like doesn't decay. If that is true, then it's crazy good. Now I'm not sure where the bike went. <laughs> they did a crash landing. Oh, it's there in the grass. Okay, we need to backtrack for that place because we had looked like a lot of good. Loot, but I also see this place. Let's start with that. But that looting will be for the next episode because now we have run out of time. Sorry for that. I hope in the next episode we can reach the Giga clan in the East Mine. If you have enjoyed watching this episode, please leave a like, it helps me a lot. Uh, leave a comment if you want and also remember to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the future episodes This has been 23. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye